about 80% of Zambia's plastic wastes ends up in the environment posing a threat to the ecosystem. This is the reason 15-year-old Safi Chiwe is on a mission to reduce plastic pollution by turning to production of durable pavers from plastics. The plastic pavers are her third innovation as she explains how this will help keep the environment clean and safe. Biodegradables do make our environment dirty, but those can rot. They have a lesser effect than these that have chemicals that destroy the soil fertility. So I decided to make plastic pavers. So this, this is my model of the plastic pavers. My first try was with a bit of quarry stones and my second try was just 100% plastic, so both can work. She wants to perfect her innovation and has explained the difference between the plastic pavers and the common brick pavers. When we get the hammer and break this, it can break. Just get the hammer and hit on it, it will break. But if you hit on this one, it won't break because of the fact that it's plastic and the fact that it has been compacted to be had. An environmentalist and Citizens Environmental and Social Concern Director has commended this initiative. In a country where we do not have any um, recycling, uh, formal recycling programs like Zambia, um, any uh, alternatives or any uh, solution or um, invention or any um, uh, initiative to see to it that to reduce plastic pollution is more than welcome. Okay, uh, we need uh, support in such kind of programs to see to it that we reduce the amount of plastic that is going to our landfills and dump sites. Experts have further called for enhanced partnerships and innovations that will tackle plastic pollution, such as this initiative. Ruth Chainda, ZNBC News, Lusaka.